for me, empowerment means you must live from a worse off situation to a better situation. Heroes and heroines are ordinary people that do extraordinary things. I don't know who's going to win. They are waiting for their name to be called. In 2014, I was appointed as the speaker of the Gauteng Provincial Legislature. And I decided I owe it to these women. Let me also do something for them. Welcome you to the Gauteng Legislature. That is the fifth annual Vita Basadi Awards. This year, those to 1,031 women were nominated in different categories. We start in the first week of July when we send out a communique to say it's now time to nominate a woman that you know and we advertise all those 10 categories. These are the people that have won. The achievement done by one woman is an achievement for all of us. Tonight is about acknowledging women in the present, but it's also about writing a history for the future. All right, and the winner for the Youth Dignitary Award is, drum roll, Litabo Monametsi. So the Youth Dignitary Award category is a category that is focused on primary school students or high school students who are example setters for their peer groups. I am a dancer. So I'm um, in South Africa, currently I'm the South African Youth Latin Champion. I'm also the South African Ballroom First Runner-Up. I'm the South African Freestyle Champion. I'm also the South African Slow Dance Champion. The winner is Lungako Matita. It's a Youth Philanthropist Award, which is actually about young people who are doing remarkable work that positive impact lives. I'm a patent founder of um, East Asia in South Africa. It's a beauty pageant that advocates for education. We open entries to university and college students nationwide, and then we disperse scholarships to our winners. Uh, I believe in you know um, adding value in people's lives because there are many people that have groomed me, you know, and um, I actually want to give back as well. I am in awe. I am in disbelief. Like this is the very first time I'm nominated for an award and actually won. So this is like a confirmation that I'm on the right path, and I'm very grateful. And the winner is Lebohang Munyati. I'm the founder of Miss South Africa, Wolche. Also, I'm the first in Africa to model in a Wolche. And I've represented South Africa in the field of Wolche basketball. And the winner is Stacey Lee Lee. I'm a law student and my hobby is car spinning, so when I'm not at university, I'm spending with, chilling with my family. That's just basically my life. I was nominated for the Woman of Honor Award. It's about women in male-dominated fields breaking boundaries. The winner is Patabili Toreke. In my community, I offer assistance to the youth. I assist them to start businesses instead of only looking at employment as an option. The category itself, it was for a community builder who is using her skills and resources to help others in the communities in, in the form of mentorship. Um, for, t for me tonight, the most important thing has been the intergenerational links. I'm sitting at a table in which there are women who were part of the 1956 Women's March. Just as Mom Sophia de Brain, even Mom and Dombi, she has gone through certain experiences and sacrifices in order for me to be here. Those women of 1956 started to level the playing field. That's why we are today. There are many gaps, yes, I agree, but there's a lot that has been done. But together, we can even still do more. The Lifetime Achievement Award for Mama Mary Ramasera Ferrari. Phenomenal women. Women who are doing good things. Excellence to me is when you're trying to do your best. You know your limits. So when you reach your limit, you are excellent. We can't be perfect, but the little bit that one does every day, you become closer to excellence. Positively impacting lives. Accepting yourself with your imperfections and embracing your flaws and having the ability to lead by example. It's really hard to achieve your ultimate excellence if you haven't necessarily tapped into who you really 
are and what your heart beats for. So excellence is breaking boundaries, leading others and opening paths for others to walk.